Hello, my friend. This is Sandy Boucher, and welcome back to Honorary Indian Daily. Today, we're looking at the May 17th entry, and it's called Just Me. Perfection is not the goal. My mother would utter those words often. Do the best you can. That's all they can ask. As the years have passed, I have thought over her words many times. And now in my 45th year, I can see that my strength is not all encompassing. My strength actually comes from simply knowing me. For example, I'm a master of self-motivation. I love a new and exciting idea, but yeah, I'm kind of lacking in the follow through department. This is simply my nature, so I ensure that the completion of a project is as exciting as the commencement by doing things that work for me. I play my favorite soundtrack of music in the background, knowing it helps me to focus. I break large tasks into smaller ones and reward each completed stage, and I limit distractions. Phone ringers can be shut off, TV schedules are irrelevant to me compared to my dreams, and time set aside for work is for work and nothing else. I know I'm a master of self-sabotage, that when I get close to finishing a task, I start to doubt whether it's good enough, whether I will be successful, and my productivity drops. Now I see the signs, and rather than running with my suddenly insanely busy schedule, I recommit to my dreams and refocus. I use positive self-talk to remind myself that I can do this, and when needed, I turn to friends, people I know who always believe in me, even when I don't. I insist on being there for family and friends, but I remind myself often that sacrificing my dreams is rarely required. Rather, I dedicate time to those who I love, and that includes me and my dreams. I don't let their challenges rob me of my dreams, and I don't use them as an excuse not to try, for I realize that the only failure is in not trying at all. No. I'm not perfect. I have my weak moments, and like anyone, I have strengths and weaknesses. But that makes me human. And all I can do is work on knowing this amazing woman I call me. It took me a lot of years to appreciate all I bring to the table. I believe I deserve to see my dreams fulfilled. And I believe you do, too. There you have it, my friend. I'd be willing to bet you can identify with today's entry and maybe even pick up a hint or two. Until tomorrow, I love you. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.